Ready? Yep. Tau Flater Mouse is filmed on location. All right, well, but welcome back, Tau Flater folks. Jeff, Officer Greg, and the Tau Flater Bruder are out here today. He has brought out a 458 SOCOM standard AR rifle, like we uh, all have. However, this AR-15 magazine, which is designed to hold 30 uh, 5.56 rounds, can actually hold 458 SOCOM rounds and they look like a big old tube of lipstick in there. However, they hit like a ton of bricks. You might be able to see down here the flat nose hand-loaded 458 SOCOM rounds that the, the uh, top leader Bruder has loaded up for us. Also, we have out here some hollow points with a nozzler ballistic tip, and I brought for you for comparison this little old 45 caliber ACP round that Officer G uh, carries in his pistol. This round fired out of this rifle is almost double the velocity of the 45 caliber handgun round so it uh, hits with a decent wallop and it's a very good uh, hunting round as you're going to see here shortly. We've got some pretty cool targets downrange for you today including Beats by Dr. Dre so <laughs> let's get to it. Okay I'm ready. Wow. It's all the different colors. Very rainbowish. Chambers is always fun. Here we go. Watch for lead. That hit. So you can see the smaller caliber hole here where that 458 flat nose plowed right in there. Obviously 12 gauge, 12 gauge but uh, that thing just burrowed right in. However, did not make it through. It wanted to. It was like a mini shotgun. The lead plate's tough, man. It is a tough plate. I thought it would go through that. Perfect for home defense. Yes. But don't put it in your pocket if you're going swimming, though. <laughs> I'm gonna aim for dead center on that orange thing. Ready? Yep. Well, who knows where it went? I would say you hit it pretty All right, center mass black top. I think 
that was on the dot if I, I think that was if right I'm off. looking right. So we were low and right, however, the result that you wanted to see is that thing bored right through this three inch thick <laughs> stainless steel plate. How many meters is that? Oh, yeah, it's like seven meters, I think. Uh, but look at that, just tore right through there, nice clean hole. Uh, that was our four, what was 460 round from a pistol. There's our 458 for SOCOM from a rifle. And then the, of course the shotgun. The shotgun that you saw in the last video that made a nice little porthole. <laughs> finger rest, a little glory hole for the finger. But yeah, man, tore right through that thing. Not even a lot of denting, just tore right through it. Yeah, that's a pretty clean hole. What's the velocity of these things? Like four or five. Oh, okay. No, I don't know. We estimated uh, what about fifteen hundred to eighteen hundred somewhere in that neighborhood. <laughs> we need a chronograph so, so we can yeah. shoot it every well, time in, in every our, video. We, we shoot it. We put our thumbs up and we measured it against that. <laughs> okay. Um, but 15 to 1800 feet per second, you know, we're looking at uh, twice the velocity of the standard 45 caliber handgun round. So that's, oh. uh, that's pretty gnarly. Also, Remote Control Sauerkraut is the name of my new Scorpions inspired uh, thrash metal band. <laughs> so. <laughs> they love the Scorpions and Kraftwerk. The winds of change. Okay, I am ready. Here we go. Oh. How did he hit the brick and nothing else? I don't know. Where was the brick? The brick was behind everything. Oh. 